Here's an update to the biosinosis clarification baskets in the canister filter that we've been using. Um, you can see that uh, the, all the fish are in the top tank. These things are all connected and I'll show you why here. But first thing I did was uh, to make sure that it stayed even cleaner was I put the biosinosis clarification basket in, in this canister filter. Um, however, as a pre-filter, I connected just another regular canister filter just completely full of coarse, medium, and fine uh, pre-filter. And so that connects there. However, you can get like a, just like a much cheaper Sun Sun uh, inline uh, pre-filter which would probably work great for any canister filter there. So that's all connected there. And then of course the all connected with that with the algae scrubber underneath here also so the reason that most of the fish are all up there and uh, I don't really clean the back there because the algae I figure filters the back I clean the front of it these two fish down here kept laying eggs um, so this is uh, they laid eggs on a stick there and so finally I took out the other fish and I put them in the top tank there. So I've done one 100% water change since adding the biosinosis clarification baskets. That was, oh, I don't know, about like a month ago, I think. So we're right now we're averaging, uh, if we kept this trend, it would be, you know, every one to two months, every two, one, one two or three months, you do 100% water change. But, uh, you know, I'm just testing it right now. You can see the little babies on, on the discus there. I've bred them a few times. It's a lot of fun. Let's see if we can get a shot there for you guys of the of the wigglers. And just today they started uh, attaching to the parents, so you can actually see they starting to eat off the parents there. Kind of fun. Anyways, dirty mirror in the background there. <laughs> Um, so far so good. Nitrates um, stay between 2 and 4 uh, always since I've added the biosinosis clarification basket um, <clears throat> and that's with feeding about um, anywhere from three, 3 to 5 cubes of food a day. So probably due for another water change here coming up soon but uh, there's there's about 90 discus babies in there, so maybe we'll grow those out for fun and see how it goes. Anyways, so far, so good. Good luck, guys.